Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm back with another Baby Alive video. Um, this is actually a box that my friends at Hasbro sent to me while I was still at school, and I actually forgot that I had this here because since they sent it to me while I was at school, my mom put it away so it wouldn't be out and in the way of stuff, and I forgot about it, and I just found it when I was cleaning up and I have not opened it, so I thought I would share it with you guys. Even though this is a bit late, it'll still be exciting to see a Baby Life product. It's not really new anymore, but at least we can still open it up and explore it together. So I really like the box that they sent this in. And by the way, this was a free product sent to me by Hasbro. They shared this with me to share with you guys. So I really love the box. It's this big pink box with question marks all over it, and it looks like a present because it is a present. And, oop, it's a little sideways, but this is so cool. So, <laughs> goodness, all right. It says, congrats, watch your new baby alive, baby grows up, transform from newborn to baby to big girl with your love and care. As you interact and nurture your baby, she will start to grow from her first bottle to first words and even learning how to stand, she grows along with you. As your baby hits all of life's major milestones, you can unveil some sweet surprises along the way that coincide with each stage of growth. With three dolls to choose from, share if your baby is happy, sweet, or dreamy on social using hashtag baby grows up. This is really cool and I think it's a really cool concept to have a doll that grows with you. And so I'm actually really excited to see this and see how they executed it. And then there's also these stickers that they sent. Um, I actually haven't really seen much about this. Um, I'm pretty sure it's already been released. Oh my goodness, look how cute! It's a um, like a height chart, so you can mark how tall they are. I wonder if she does get taller. That's something I'm very curious about. Um, yeah, I'm really interested to see how they did this. Cause like I said, I haven't really seen much about this doll. I'm pretty sure it has been released already. And also, I like how the inside of the box looks like a crib. That's really cute. So it says, I really grow. So I'm actually very curious to see if she does get taller, if the size of the doll changes at all. Oh, and it's a surprise if she has brown hair or blonde hair. I'm very curious to see that. Her eyebrows look a little blonde, but you never know. And she speaks English and Spanish with 75 plus sounds and phrases. And it says, baby grows up. And then there's one, two, three, with little question marks on each. So let's flip it over to the back. Only you can make her grow up, and she changes size as she grows. That's so interesting. So newborn wiggles and opens her eyes. Baby sits up and says her first word. And then big girl grows taller and hair gets longer. Wow. That's so interesting. And then it looks like there's little surprise things for all of the um, stages. Oh, and her eye color is different with the different um, hair colors, and that's why her eyes are sleeping. And then it says to open here, so let's do it. Oops, I need my knife to cut this tape. This one is not plastic repackaging, but it does seem like there's minimal pl plastic. All right, this is gonna be so cool. I'm actually really excited. I don't know why I'm, okay, here we go. Um, I can just slide it out like this. All right. So, got our baby. I feel like we're definitely gonna need the instructions because I'm not quite sure how this is gonna work. And then right here, oh, it shows the different names and all kinds of different things. So, we have one of these, but there are three different skin tones, a little tan baby, a um, light skin baby, and a dark skin baby. And then on this side, it's showing like what you can do to make her grow up. So that's really cool. All right. I like how she's wrapped up like a little present. And you can put her name right here, which is really cool. Yeah, you can put her birthday, her um, hair color, and her eye color. So you can figure out which one she is. Let's get her out. Oh, she's already making noise. Well, hello. Let's see. We don't even have her accessories out yet, but we do have the baby. She has not opened her eyes. She wants the bubba. We don't have the stuff yet. Here we go. This little green one is meant for newborn. How do we get it out? Here we go. All right, for number one for the baby. 
Uh, oops. Sorry, baby. Hope she doesn't know I dropped that on her. Oh, she's crying. I think she does know. Okay. Inside here, we have a purple bottle. Um, it does not actually open. You can't actually feed her anything. And there's stickers. And then there's also this, which... Oh, they're little activity sheets. This baby's so cute. And this one, I like her hair. So yeah, these are little activity sheets you can play with. Let's play with the baby. All right, let's see if we give her a bottle. She'll open her eyes. <gasps> oh my goodness. All right, she has brown eyes and let's see her hair. <gasps> it looks like blonde hair. Can I take the hat off or should I keep it on? I'm a little confused. Where did I put this? Yeah. I think we keep the hat on for now. Aw, hello. So yeah, I think we can rock her and give her the bottle and that'll make her grow up. I'm like trying to rock her on camera. It's a little hard. Let's see. Do you hear that? I don't know when she'll get bigger. <laughs> her eyes, um, oh look and she has the smallest amount of like cute hair. This reminds me of a doll I used to have when I was younger that had growing hair. <laughs> so she's got a little bit of hair. And she has brown eyes and, oh, so what name is she? Shining Skylar. So that's pretty cute. Okay, so the instructions are saying to just repeat the actions, which would be rocking and feeding her until she grows up on her own. It's saying she will unswaddle herself on her own. Her eyes do blink and her hair is molded except for this little like ponytail that is real hair. And I like that her eyes blink. She cannot actually drink, but her tongue has a little button that lets her know when you're pressing on it, which is what the bottle will do. Oh. <gasps> All right, so as you can see, she just um, grew up into baby. So now she is baby and we can uh, sit her up. She's babbling. Oh, she said bottle. Let's get her new accessories out from number two. She gets new accessories in stage two. Oh, did you hear that? She got a little pink bib and it looks like a little fruit pouch. Like, you know, one of those like squeeze pouches. Snack please. Snack please, okay. She can talk all of a sudden. Let's put this on, her bib. Did she know? It looks like she kind of wiggles a little bit. He's yummy. So let's take a peek at her outfit. Um, oh, it's supposed to stay up, is it? Until she gets older. But she has um, this little planet onesie on and it's supposed to look like a onesie. I think it just folds down when she gets older. I, I think. Actually, no. I don't know. <laughs> it's like a planet dress. I guess you could fold it up into a onesie. I don't know. That might have just been because of how she was. Oh, and also she has this bow I forgot to mention. I don't think her hair got any longer this time around, but um, she also wiggles like this. She has been doing that as she's been sitting here. Yeah, oh, I think you're supposed to, you're supposed to bounce her when she's a baby. That's one of her actions. And also just give her the food. Let's give her some more. She said it's yummy. Playtime? Playtime. See, she kind of rocks like side to side like this. That's pretty cute. <laughs> and pressing her bracelet does make her interact. I like the bouncing because she can't stand quite yet. She still sits. Press my, press my bracelet. Hold my hand. <gasps> Whoa, oh. I'm growing. <laughs> she's growing and now she's standing up. She is so tall now. Did her hair grow though? I'm not sure. 
her hair grew. I love my big girl outfit. So it's saying that um, active play, bouncing, and pressing her bracelet will cause her to respond. And you can use gentle force. To, oh, you can extend her hair. Whoa. Oh, oh I was supposed to do that myself last time. Oh, wow. Her hair is really long now. Look at that. And it's really soft, too. And she also goes into sleep mode. Oh, let's check out what her new accessories are in this in this one. So much is happening all at once. I'm sorry this is a little all over the place. Let's see. Wow. In her um, toddler stage, she gets these cute little pink jelly shoes with stars on them. Oh wait, she has a skirt before anything. She has a sparkly skirt. Oh my goodness. That's really cute. And then she got a brush. So much is happening. And also she can stand on her own. Like she was just standing there all by herself. Yeah, she's just standing all by herself. And she looks so cute. So I know a lot just happened like all at once. And you also don't have to... You don't have to rush the actions the way that I did. I was speeding it up a lot because I wanted to show you guys in the video what everything is and how she works, but you could always take your time and play with her um, a lot slower. But I would love to take a closer look at the doll herself. Um, so like I mentioned, her head doesn't move, her arms do move, and um, she has movement right here. So she can rock back and forth and her legs now that she's grown like bend and snap a little bit like she can sit like this they don't snap into place though but they snap to make her stand so she can stand completely up and they don't go well they do go further back but if they're like this she can stand so that's pretty cute and then i wanted to take her outfit off and actually look at her body because i'm pretty curious to see how this works i don't know if it's meant to come off. Let's see, it velcro's on the bottom, which is really strange. I don't think you're meant to see what's underneath. Because this is like the um, battery pack. I don't really see the, um... oh yeah. Up here, she has the, you can set her to mommy or daddy and off. Um, I'm actually gonna turn her off for a little bit. Um, but mommy and daddy were um, features they added a couple years ago, so you could have um, playtime for a girl or a boy, which is really nice, um, cause dolls are not just for girls, so I was really excited when they added that feature, that the dolls could say daddy. And I don't know if you're actually supposed to take the outfit off, it doesn't, it's like not designed in a way that feels like you can remove it, I think it's actually attached, yeah it is, it's attached to her leg, so you cannot take this one outfit off, if you wanted to give her a different outfit you'd have to put it over this one, which is not the best, in uh, my opinion, as someone who likes to redress my dolls. I don't love when they have permanent clothing, but it's not too big of a deal. But I could tell from looking underneath that she did get taller because her torso extended. You can see right here there's this little, um, it's hard to see, but there's a little screw and her torso did grow when she went from baby to toddler. So that's actually pretty cool. She is a bigger doll now than she was when she started. So it is really interesting and I think they executed this really well. It was interesting to see a growing doll. There hasn't really been anything like this before. And so I really like it. Um, her hair, I like, I just, it's so soft. It's fun to play with. It's super long. I was surprised at how much came out. I was not expecting it to be that long. But this doll is really cute, and so, um, like it mentioned, there's actually like six different variations because of the surprise element. Because um, there's only three skin tones, but there are two different variations per skin tone. But it's a surprise, so it's not guaranteed that you would get the one that you want. I think you can kind of like guess by their eyebrows, but um, it seems a little hard. Like their eyebrows look the same, and theirs look a little the same, but these two, it's a bit easier to tell. But it is really cool, and I think all the dolls are really cute. This doll is actually really cool. I love all of the features that she has and how she really grows up. It's very unique. I don't think I've ever seen a doll like this. 
As I mentioned, um, I have seen like a few features like this in dolls from when I was younger. Like I had a doll that her hair would grow in a similar way to this. Um, but I've never seen like anything like this where it goes from newborn to baby to toddler. And I think it's really unique and it's really well executed. Everything works really well and I like that you have to do interactions to make her grow up rather than just it just does it. Um, I don't think it's reversible unless there is a way in the instructions on how to reset it, but I think it's like a one and done type deal, the way everything seems um, pretty permanent because I they probably want you to like, you know, you can't really push the hair back in. Like I pulled this to come out. I don't think you can push it back in and I don't really think her body would go back down. So now she's like in the toddler stage. And like I mentioned, she grew. She's definitely taller than your average baby alive, which is really cool because then she could be more of like a big sister, whereas a lot of the time, most of the dolls are around the same size, so that's also really cool. And then all the accessories are really cute too. She came with a ton of accessories and um, they're really neat and I like how everything's themed. She's like space themed, so everything is kind of uh, looking like that, but I like how there were different surprises for each of her different like stages in life and also the cute little coloring activity and you could even like have her do it instead of you so that's pretty cute. I definitely would recommend this. This is really cool. I definitely would have loved it all like this when I was younger and I still love her now when I'm 19 so <laughs> that definitely <laughs> tells you something about baby life. They know what they're doing. This is definitely a really cool doll. She's so unique. I really like her and I'd love to see more things like this. Um, it's very unique and I love that Baby Live is always like thinking of different ways to make their dolls realistic and like interactive because they are called Baby Alive and having her grow up is definitely like alive and so I really like that. I think it's very cool and on brand for them. Yeah. And I'd love to see more boy dolls. Like it'd be cool if they did another version with some boys too. I think that'd be neat and I'd like to see how they would do that. I don't know, they couldn't really do hair because, yeah, but the growing up features could definitely work for a boy doll too. But yeah, anyway, thank you again to my friends at Hasbro for sending me this doll. She's super cool. I'm sorry my video is so late with her. I thought I'd still post it anyway because we can all enjoy her. I had a lot of fun playing with her. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you later. Bye!